welcome back to Craster. I'm Jerry, and y'all know Mike. How's it going, everybody? All right, so uh, we're sitting here. Mike, I have a question for you. Um, do you feel like every good road leads to a good fishing spot or crawfishing spot? Oh, man, you know what? I know one thing. One real bad road <laughs> took us to a crawfish boil. Jake and I, we were shooting yeah. a video, our father-son fishing trip with a crawfishing trip, and uh, we went down this road. We should not have gone down in our truck. Well, we're going to let you guys watch this. This is crazy, man. But uh, almost wrecked our truck, went over this berm, and uh, you won't believe what we found. We'll be back with you here in just a minute. Oh, oh, oh. You're a barb. I know. Oh my gosh. We almost crashed. <laughs> Holy cow. Uh oh. Uh, not good. Oh. 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 That almost um, that hurt. Whoa! Hold on, big guy. Oh, hit the wire again. Oh, that's gonna leave a mark. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh. Well, the truck may be worse for wear, but we made it. Oh. They have crayfish traps. Yeah. Or, or some sort of trap. Oh, man, I got two questions for you. Shoot. What in the heck were you thinking, Mike, on that road? <laughs> I was thinking I just wanted to take my son crawfishing. We were out, we were out shooting a video. We started going down this road, start turning into a goat trail. There was nowhere oh to turn back. Gosh. We got out of there. That was the good thing. And then, Mike, what happened next? Oh, man, then we come up over that last berm, and we came down, and there was this truck blocking us in some boulders. We couldn't get out. And I was like, I was like, hey, man, I don't know if I can get around you. This guy's like, ah, oh, you know, do I need to move my truck? And he ended up moving his truck, and I went out. I just passed him, and I was looking at my flashlight. I was looking at the damage to my truck. And out of the dark, I hear, Mike? <laughs> and it was somebody who watches our YouTube channel. Check this out. The best thing is, is later, a couple weeks later, they invited us to a crawfish boil. Ah, oh, man, come on with us. Oh, man, we are, we are coming out and we met a couple people who watch our YouTube channel. What's your names? I'm Jordan. I'm Carly. Hey. We designed our trap off of Mike's. Oh, that's cool, man. Look at that. Looks like a creaster trap. That's awesome, you guys. We never mind that people uh, make traps like theirs for their own personal use. Oh, I bet you guys are going to catch a ton of crawfish tonight, aren't you? Oh, we I definitely so. are. Oh, man, Jake and I just had a boil right down by the lake and shot a little video. Well, it's nice to meet you guys. Nice to meet you. And uh, we'll uh, see you on YouTube. Awesome. <laughs> the legend of Crawfish Carly <laughs> begins. Oh man, you guys know how to crawfish, don't you? Oh yeah. Hey, here's <laughs> There we go. Oh man, what a pro. Looks like you've done that before. A few times, you know. Just the other day. <laughs> Alright, now. Looks like a pretty good cooler crawfish. Nice, Carly. Is that enough? That looks like plenty. Yep. And then you just shut it and let it steam on in. That creole will be delicious. Oh, 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 yeah. He's going to cover you. Watch out, love. Watch out, love. Oh, oh that's it, buddy. Oh. That's the nicest dump yet. <laughs> I love it, baby. Right? All right. All the beers. Yeah. All the beers. All the beers. You're running out of table. Yeah. Go back up. Go back. <laughs> yeah, you are running out of table. Oh man, that is one great looking pile of steaming crawfish. Wow. 
Tell us. You're gonna take some pictures too, Doc. Yes. Will you send them? How can you not take pictures? Oh. That is beautiful. That was close. That is oh, absolutely cool. beautiful. All right. Yeah, I'll show you. Okay, here, you want to see my secret? Yes. Go work. Okay, hold on. Oh, wait, y'all. Oh, Jerry's, Jerry's gonna do just one more little thing. Oh, Jerry got distracted while I was teaching. Oh, man. Sorry. You know what? This is right here. There was boobs. Oh, yeah. Hey, Carly, let me do this. Hang this over your bed. It makes babies. Oh, man. So, throw it away right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, so here's my secret, okay? This, this is this is how you how you get a get one undone oh. super clean. Okay? There you go. So that everybody always cracks pretty pretty it up good. here. Mm -hmm. Carly, you, you yeah, cracked it up here. Okay. And, and you pulled out a bunch of stuff. I go down one ring, burns. and then I just pull out the meat. That's the most. So you get less of the guts that way. Uh-huh. And then I just pull that out right there, and I'm done. That's cool. it. So I actually, so this whole is actually stuff quite a bit in a little bit. So this right here. Well, I actually huh? learned no. a pretty so, cool thing. Are you all in your forehead? Just add that. 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 Just add so, Joe, check when this out. We learned this the other day, okay? So, when you got this thin out this way, you get the little one, you just wiggle like it back and forward, okay. and then you take that part. Mm. Mm. And then here, right? I want him to show yeah, me his way, too. So, you got those two fins there? Uh huh. So one with your one hand. So, I'm just doing it upside down, maybe. Second that's one. Okay. Yeah. Fish, carry, Oh, yeah, you got a bucket. That's why. I was doing it upside down. Then you take this little bit of meat, pinch the end of the tail. George is like all the little spoons to okay. make it feel big. And then you take so, like, this little part. Okay. So I got that. Part. Oh, I want to start And then you feel the <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You can also, you know, do the little fan and pull that and do all so. that. So. Well, we've watched quite a few videos. Yeah. It's easier. I'll tell you, I've watched all the videos over the years, man. We've watched the hell out of dudes. All them late nights when we've been out there working, well, I say working loosely. I mean, sitting there bored out of a goddamn gourd. <laughs> We've been watching your guys' videos like, how in the hell are they pulling those out of the snake river like that? <laughs> Son of a bitch, damn, we're gonna change the traps here. That's awesome. Yep. I mean, luckily, damn, it's supposed to have the traps. You guys weren't. Yeah, damn, really was. I was getting super pissed at that guy. I know, also, dude. I think I like the headset. And I'm totally, do you? I think I'm in Some wood. people do. And you know what? I'm totally. <laughs> that makes you marry some cereal. <laughs> Good <laughs> work, sir. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'll be saying, I've been doing this for years and never ran across these guys. That's funny because I was looking at oh, my truck because I, I missed just one. Thank wrecked God. it into a fence pole. And, and then all of a sudden, here, in the dark, I'm like oh, looking at my truck with a flashlight and like, Mike? <laughs> okay. So like that. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. What do you think of the big boil that Jordan and Crawfish Carly caught? <laughs> yeah, it doesn't get better than this. Great job, you guys. Thanks for inviting us. Uh, thank you. You guys are the best. Oh, there will be. That's a garbage buggy right there. Jerry needs his bib over here. So he needs his bib over here. So he needs his bib. Why are you still with his bib? Well, we have top towels. Yeah. Will you actually grab? Say hi to Mike. Hi, Mike. Hi, Mike. We're gonna go get some craze. Go back, we'll back out of here. Creature keeper here. Oh, we got escapees. 
We got runners. Look for some big ones here. Yeah, there's a couple big ones. There's a big one right there. Look at that. There you go. Hold that one up there. There we go. <laughs> nice big blue cross. How's that look? That looks good. That's what it looks like. That looks tasty. All right. some more to the pot. There's one left. That one that decided he'd try to hang on, huh? That's a smaller one, but that's a blue cross. See that big blue belly in there? All right. Creature keeper is starting. Got a few in there. Get those all buoyed up and in the water. What is it? Hey guys, this is uh. My wife Amber, she's pulling up one of the other Chrysler traps with Ethan. We got a couple good crayfish there, and we got a bluegill in there. Mom, what fell in the water? Hey guys, I had to show you this. This is a uh, from last night we had a big storm coming in so my son and I had to go out and we had to uh, pull all the traps account of them flooding and we didn't want to lose them I found some pretty interesting things especially with a couple of these and you can also see we have two monsters in here here's one of them him here's one guy and he's a beast and then here's the other one I mean I think we almost got in a range of a lobster here he made he uh, measured almost seven and a half inches long. Then we had some, a couple other ones with bigger claws. We got some measurements, and then of course some smaller ones. But this was just in five traps, and like I said, it was before a bad storm. They were definitely calling for major major flooding and all, and we got a nice little feast here. And I think I have a couple different, in, a couple interesting, I think there's possibly two to three species here. I'm going to try to tr look them up and figure them out because this is one to learn, one separate type. This guy right here. And of course that one. I think that's the normal ones around here. And this was just in a nice creek, nice little spring fed creek all these actually came out of and then of course there's a as soon as I can find it there's some here that have an off blue almost like a fresh another some type of freshwater crayfish and then you have some smaller ones they do have a uh, invasive species around here called a rusty crayfish all right I'll talk to you guys later